time is of the essence here. You know, you never know how much time you have left. And so I started thinking about that, and uh, my contract was ending at the end of the year. I turned 65 years old, and most importantly, my daughter's giving birth to our first grandchild in January. And so the time has kind of converged and made it possible for us. And we started thinking about it, and this is not a bad time to do it. Uh, as long as uh, we've got time left to enjoy the things, the fruits of the labor in life. I'm going to miss the camaraderie of the newsroom, of the excitement of, of going after a story, of all of us pulling together as a team to, to try to uh, garner that great bit of information. Uh, the, uh, the adrenaline of breaking news uh, as it happens to talk about it uh, as, as you're seeing it. Uh, so many good things in news about that. You know, I'm not going to miss the stories about all the bad things that have happened to children. Uh, that bothers me the most to talk about. I'm not going to miss about that. But to communicate the good and the bad in the world, the, the things that are relevant to people's lives, you know, I'll miss being able to tell those stories. I certainly will. Well, my plans are to get bored at the start, but uh, my wife said, hold on, Buster. That's not going to happen. She's got plans for me. I have lots of projects around this house to keep up with. I do want to play a little more tennis if possible and, uh, you know, play some guitar and, and uh, just enjoy life. I have been the luckiest guy in the world. I have an incredible family. I have had a 43 almost year run in this broadcast continually on television in Jacksonville, Florida and in Charlotte, North Carolina. I have been treated great by the television stations I've worked for and I've been able to meet so many people, do so many events, go so many places. I never thought this would happen to me. This has been truly a blessed life, and I just don't know why I deserve it, to be honest with you, I don't. But I've enjoyed every step of the way, and you know, for those who say get a job that you never feel like you have to work, well for 43 years there's not a day gone by that I felt like I've actually been at work. I've enjoyed it that much.